apologies for not being able to see me today, um, but I hope you can all hear me. So I just wanted to get these July um, predictions or insights up for you as soon as I possibly can. And this is the quickest and easiest way to do so. So without further ado, let's just jump straight into what this month of July has in store for your sun, your moon and your rising sign. Hi Aquarius, suns, moons and rising signs. Okay, so um, what they showed me for you guys was firewood and it was all kind of put together in a way that was going to create some sort of bonfire, only you seem to be struggling with getting the fire going, um, like you really genuinely couldn't, couldn't light the fire, so I mean symbolically, I mean like everything they show me is symbolic, Um, could mean different things for different people but I kind of took this as your heart's not in something, it's either that or perhaps the way that something is coming about it feels dishonourable because like as you're kind of like doing it I kind of see you kind of looking down and like you're holding a rose Um, but I mean the expression on your face it it wasn't happy you know you kind of looked a bit more like defeated like you were giving up you know um I mean in theory however like the impression was that you should be really happy with something but for some reason like you're not um I mean roses could relate to relationships um, roses had thorns so there could have been an argument or something that's happened or perhaps like you're thinking back to um, an old relationship maybe usually not though Aquarius tend to be very like stick with the present that or the future you know uh, cancers are a little bit more you know stuck in the past um, so I don't know why but you're feeling a bit defeated it's like I mean fire's I kind of resonate with Leo which is like your opposite sign which would be like relationships and they're very much heart-centered people um Leo's it's all about the heart it's all about feelings you know um so I don't know and the fact that you couldn't get it going was it kind of just felt like your heart's not in it or like I mean I don't know I just feel like you feel stuck like you're exactly where you want to be, there should be happiness here, there should be a lot of enjoyment, you know, but there is something that's missing, like there's something, because you can't get the fire going, you know, Um, you're not in it fully, so some of you could also be kind of um, being strong, you know, suppressing a feeling, um, trying to push something to, to the side, but you're clearly stressed out or burdened by whatever this is because the expression is is like you're looking down you're looking a bit glum like self-defeated um you know so there's something kind of going on here where you're feeling a bit trapped maybe and yet you know the bonfire is outside so you know you're free more free than you have been in a really long time but there's something that's missing I feel so I mean I'm not I'm not actually sure like what this means it's kind of baffled me a little bit um perhaps you know something will make a little bit more sense as the month kind of progresses you'll have to keep me updated and let me know um but yeah this is just what I get for you guys um hopefully it does resonate I mean if you would like a personal reading with me please visit my website it's www.askalittlewitch.com And I will see you for the mid-month. So thank you again and I will speak to you soon. Bye.